Hey, welcome to Board Game Casual, and today we're looking at these Roxley Iron Clays. These are poker chip style game counters or game coins that you can use to replace the cardboard money tokens that come in most games. Now, this happens to be the larger 200 count pack, but Roxley also makes a smaller 100 count size. This set retails for $90 on Roxley's site, though I got mine for quite a bit cheaper at Game Nerds. By the way, there's another video on the channel if you're interested in seeing me unbox these in a Game Nerds order. This set includes 40 of the 1 chips, 40 of the 5 chips, 20 of the 10 chips, 40 of the 20 chips, and 20 each of the 50s, 100s, and 500s. It comes in this slick, stylish cardboard box with a magnetic lid, which feels really nice to the touch. Inside, there are two plastic trays that hold the iron clays. These clever ribbons are a nice touch, making it easy to pull out each tray. So make sure you have the ribbon under the tray when you put them back in the box. The trays themselves are nice and sturdy. Each tray has a snap-on semi-transparent cover and are designed to hold the iron clays perfectly. The iron clays themselves look and feel great. The weight and tactile feel is so satisfying to pick up and hold, stack, or throw into your pile. They also look fantastic. Roxley did a great job here with a design that looks like it belongs in most games. To give you some more context, here's what the iron clays look like compared to some generic clay poker chips. You can see the diameter is about the same, but the iron clays are a little bit thicker, which I like. And here's what they look like compared to some Splendor tokens, which are of course just made of plastic, but still a really nice token that I'm sure many of you are familiar with. You can see that the Splendor tokens are actually a little bit larger, and honestly I prefer the Splendor token size. But it's so minute, you probably wouldn't notice the difference unless you were holding both at the same time. So the big question is, are they worth it? That's a tough one because these things are pretty expensive. You can get really nice clay poker chips on Amazon for pretty cheap. I think you can get nice sets for around 15 to 20 bucks. And while I really like the iron clays box, cardboard isn't nearly as nice as the wooden case that these poker chips came in, for example. But I also don't wanna play board games using poker chips. They just don't feel right. Using generic poker chips with a board game to me feels hacky. It makes me feel like I'm playing a prototype rather than a finished game. They don't feel like they belong and it just takes me out of the experience. These iron clays, however, they feel at home in almost any game. If you pull these out as currency for a game of Camel Up or Champions of Midgard, Architects of the West Kingdom, or even a game of Ready, Set, Bet, people would never know that they aren't a stock part of the game. Without a doubt, these are a luxury item. They're certainly not a must have. I mean, for this price, you could buy yourself two, three, maybe four new games instead. But for me, I think they're worth it, especially if you can find them on sale. I just don't like cardboard coins and those tiny plastic coins in the latest printing of Camel Up are terrible. So I'm really stoked to be able to use these as a game upgrade. But even then, these aren't cheap enough where I can just buy a set and throw them in the box of any game I wanna upgrade. If you take Lost Ruins of Arnak, for example, it's a lot more affordable to buy some cheap metal coins off Amazon and throw them directly in the box. What's a shame here is that Roxley is the only game in town. My hope is that other poker chip manufacturers or game manufacturers will start making their own versions of board game style chips that look less casino-y. That would hopefully put a lot more affordable options on the table. I mean, how nice would it be if you could cheaply upgrade all your games to Splendor quality tokens? That said, if you put the price aside, these iron clays are an awesome quality product and a great addition to any board game shelf. I definitely recommend them. This 200 count set is probably enough for my needs, but to be honest, I'm keeping an eye out. If a really good deal pops up, I wouldn't mind getting another set. Hey, thanks so much for watching. I hope you found this video useful if you're on the fence about getting some iron clays. And thanks so much to those who've subscribed. It really means a lot to me to see this channel grow. I'll see you next time here on Board Game Casual.